So Pulpo woman is recovering after she tells police a man tased her in the chest and then broke into her home. News on 6's Mallory Thomas is live with why the victim says she opened the door to the stranger late last night. Yeah, the victim tells police that there was a man who knocked on her door twice late last night. She says the first time he left, but he quickly returned. Things started with a knock on the door. They opened the door and uh, he asked for a cigarette. So. She goes and gets a cigarette, gives it to him, and he leaves. So Pulpa Captain Glenn Coffey says police think the man may have been scoping out the apartment. I'm guessing that's the case at this point in time because that's exactly what he did. He come, he knocked, he gets a cigarette, you know, he's able to look inside the door while it's open uh, and decides to come back five minutes later. This time when he knocks on the door, the victim says the man had a taser. He pulls out of his pocket uh, what she's calling a taser and tases her uh, in the chest. Uh, she falls to the floor. She says the man grabbed her backpack full of important documents. Social security card, some cash, and other miscellaneous items like that that most people like keep in a purse. The victim was able to give police a description of the thief. Police say while home invasions are scary, they aren't something that they see regularly. And the second time, taking that chance of being noticed uh, or recognized, uh, you know, that's, that's just not something that we hear around here. Police brought the canine officer out with them last night. It did they were able to find a scent, but say that they were not able to find that man. Reporting live in Sepulpa, Mallory Thomas, Oklahoma Zone News on Six.